Top 5 Free Things to Do in Paris Paris ranks second among the most visited cities in the world just behind Bangkok, despite being crazy expensive. So there must be something special about Paris. It's the city of love, and love is expensive, right? Doesn't have to be. Paris has much more to offer than the Eiffel Tower and being a love capital. There are a lot of fun and free attractions ranging from classical museums to galleries, architectural buildings, observing classical culture, and many more that you can enjoy on a budget in Paris. Let's look at the top five free ones. This is Cheap Travel Buddy, your go-to place for budget travel tips. Follow us on Instagram at Cheap Travel Buddy for more content. Straight into the video. Number one, free walking tour around Paris. Free walking tours are a great way to explore Paris and learn about its history, culture, and landmarks without spending any money. These tours are typically led by knowledgeable and passionate local guides who provide an in-depth look at the city's most famous sites and hidden gems. They are generally offered on a pay-what-you-like basis, which means you can decide how much to tip your guide at the end of the tour based on your experience. The tours usually cover famous areas such as the Marais, Montmartre, the Latin Quarter, and the Champs-Élysées. They often start at a central location, such as Notre Dame Cathedral or the Louvre Museum, and take you on a journey through the city's streets, squares, and landmarks. You will learn about the history of Paris, including the city's architecture, art, culture, and famous figures. Some free walking tours in Paris also offer themed tours, such as a food tour, a literary tour, or a ghost tour. These are a great way to delve deeper into a specific aspect of the city's culture. Number two, visit the museums. Many of Paris's most famous museums offer free admission at certain times or on specific days of the week. Museums like the Louvre, Musée d'Orsay, and Centre Pompidou offer free admission for everyone under the age of 18 and for EU citizens and residents under the age of 26. They offer completely free admission on the first Sunday of every month from October to March to everyone. Another great way to visit Paris museums for free is by visiting the city's many smaller museums. Many of these museums are lesser known but just as exciting and informative as the larger ones. Some examples include the Musée de la Chasse et de la Nature, the Musée des Arts et Métiers, and the Musée National des Arts Asiatiques Guimet. Even if you are not eligible for free admission, many museums offer discounted tickets for students, seniors, and other groups. It's also a good idea to check the museum's website or contact them in advance to confirm the free admission hours and days. Number 3. See the Eiffel Tower. Sparkle at night. The view of the sparkling Eiffel Tower is magical and you can see it for free. During the illumination hours, the lights are turned on for five minutes every hour, from sunset until 1 a.m. You can also see the tower from several places in the city, such as the Trocadero or the Champ de Mars. These places offer great views of the tower and the light show. You can also take a walk along the Seine River Bank and enjoy the view of the tower from a distance. You can also see the Eiffel Tower sparkle for free by visiting the Parc des Buttes Chaumont. This park is located in the 19th arrondissement of Paris, and from the top of the hill, you can get a great view of the Eiffel Tower. It is lovely during the illumination hours and a great spot to enjoy a picnic while taking in the view. Visiting the Eiffel Tower during the day is free, but you have to pay to go to the top or take the elevator. However, you can still see the tower and take pictures from the base and the surrounding area. Number four, attend a free concert. Attending free concerts in Paris is a great way to experience the city's vibrant music scene without breaking the bank. Paris has a rich musical heritage and a variety of venues that offer free concerts throughout the year. One of the best places to attend free concerts is at the Philharmonie de Paris. The Philharmonie is a modern concert hall located in the Parc de la Villette and offers free concerts regularly. These concerts feature a wide range of music from classical to jazz and are open to the public. Parisian churches also have recitals often that you can attend for free. Churches like Notre Dame Cathedral have Gregorian chant on Sunday morning. St. Eustache Church has free organ recital on Sundays from 5.30 p.m. and so on. L'Officiel des Spectacles which comes out every Wednesday, has concert listings that always include free concerts, and the venues change from week to week. And at number five, free gardens in Paris. Paris is home to many beautiful gardens that offer free admission. With plenty of green spaces, fountains, and sculptures to admire, they're the perfect place to relax and soak in the Parisian atmosphere. 
Bring your picnic blanket and some French baguette and cheese and voila, you got yourself a romantic Parisian picnic. Luxembourg Garden, Parc des Buttes Chaumont, Parc Montsouris, Bois de Vincennes, and Bois de Boulogne are some of the most beautiful parks you can visit for free. It will be a separate video if we want to discuss them in detail, but just list these parks so you won't forget. So these are the five free things to do in Paris. If you have been to Paris before, comment down your experiences and I will reply to them. That's all for today. Follow our Instagram at Cheap Travel Buddy for more travel content. Like and share this video with your travel group. Also, comment down more activities you can do for free, and I will include them in the next videos. Thank you, and have a good day. Keep traveling.